tutorials by Andrew Buckle. In this tutorial, I'm just going to show you how you can use the divide objects below command to create some interesting cookie cutter designs in Illustrator. Now, I've actually set the command, and I'm just quickly going to go, I've got a rectangle I'm going to be using for design, object and path and divide objects below, and I've actually set up a quick shortcut via the, just quickly go there, edit and keyboard shortcuts. So I've just set that, just so I can quickly go command U. Of course you can set your own one up, whatever you want, but we can just go to the menu command. Now, what you can do then is I'm just going to quickly create a, some paths. Now the one thing about the paths is that you can't have a gap. It has to be one continuous shape, so, so it's not much use if you've got like a sort of a, a ring design or something. So it has to be a so you just join those together, join that together. So you can actually sort of make blob designs, but it all has to be continuous. So just got that. Just go over here and click Unite. Now, Control C. So I'm actually putting it into the pasteboard clipboard. Okay, let's say copy. Just going to remove that and paste that on. Now, what you can do once you've got that, you can actually then resize that and do. Okay. Divide, obviously I could just go to object and path and divide. I'm just doing it quickly, just using that shortcut. Then I can go over again, add another one, drag it over there, U again, and control V. So I just quickly paste them in, U, and so on and so on. Do that. And also one thing is you can actually go, obviously, further out than the actual path itself. So you can extend it out and you of course can rotate it as well. So you just rotate that around and again. There. Now once you've done that, what you can do then, so you don't even have to ungroup it, it's already split apart. So just you can just go like that or instead of doing that you can actually say re recover it. Go over there, recolor that. Recolor that one, and so on and so on. You can see you can build up quite complex designs, but again, let's say you can just use it to cookie cutter and remove. Like that. Of course, you'll notice there's a little bit there to remove as well. Okay, hope you found this of interest. Thank you very much.